Hello everybody, it's me, your favorite Aunt Glenda, and I think you and I both know what we're here to talk about today. This is a public service announcement for all of you out there that love to talk about fall. You know the fall, the season fall? My goodness, when did it become such a big thing to talk about how much you love the fall, how you can't wait to have pumpkin spice lattes, you want to put pumpkin spice in everything. I mean, you want to put it in your lattes, you want to put it in your bread, you want to put it in muffins, you want to put it in your house, scent it as a candle. You can take that pumpkin spice and stick it right up your Anyway, my point is, it is still August, you guys. It's like, what, August 20 something? It's not September. It's not even close to feeling like fall. It's 102 degrees outside every single day here in Southern California. And I don't care what you say, or no matter how many times you throw pumpkins and jack-o'-lanterns and witches and leaves and pumpkin spice everything in my face at the stores, it is not gonna feel like fall or be fall until it is fall. And fall is not right now. All right, you guys, can I be honest with you for a minute? I'm gonna tell you what got me on this whole pumpkin spice ramp page. I went to the store the other day. I told you Hobby Lobby is my new thing. And everywhere you look, every single shelf that you look on, there's fall this, there's fall that. There's not just fall. No. Now there's Christmas and Monica. And while I do love both of those holidays, I'm really not ready to celebrate them in August. I mean, come on, that's ridiculous, don't you think? I just can't believe it. And you know, it's something about this young generation where they're like, oh, oh, I would love to have my fall boots on. And I like to wear my Ugg boots with leggings and a chunky cable knit sweater. It makes me feel cozy. I mean, come on. Really? There's only so many cats you can pet and books you can read and pumpkin spice you can drink before you just want to vomit. I mean, it's disgusting. And you know how much I love YouTube and all you YouTubers out there. But I'm going to tell you something. You YouTubers, including my niece Sarah, I mean, in August, you're starting to decorate your house and you go, oh, decorate with me for fall. Watch me throw some dead leaves on my mantle for fall. Look how beautifully I scattered some acorn carcasses on my table. It looks like a gorgeous harvest festival. It's ridiculous. What you have is you have a bunch of dead plants on your table. That's what you're doing and you're calling it fall decor. And I mean, it's fine if you want to do that in September, October, November even the early weeks of December, but not in August. Absolutely not in August. You know what I say to that? It's not fall. Shut the hell up. All right, and let's talk about everybody's love for back to school. Sarah's prancing around the house. She won't shut up about pencils and new crayons and the smell of these new crayons. Let's be honest. I mean, who here actually can say that they like school? Anybody? Anybody? I mean, really? And when did school start school in August? When I was a girl, I know I hate to keep bringing that up, but when I was a girl, we didn't start school till mid-September. I mean, then you started to feel like it was fall, okay? And you know me, I love a harvest, I love a good hay ride. I love some other good things in the hay too, if you know what I mean, you know. But, but, I love a hay ride. I love pumpkins, I love to go to the pumpkin patch. I just don't love doing it this early in the year. And I know I might come off like a grump to you guys, and I'm sorry, because I know, you know, I know normally when you tune into something with Aunt Glenda, you're expecting to feel good about yourself, okay? You're expecting to feel loved. You know, I, I just, I, I let off this warmth about me. Everybody says that. You know, I'm not a judgmental person. I'm very kind, I'm very sweet, I'm very giving. And I know in this video, some of you might be a little shocked, because Aunt Glenda is not my normal happy self. And I'm sorry for that. But. You know what I say to that? It's not fall, so shut the hell up. Now, don't get me wrong, hon. I love the fall season as much as the next gal. I mean, there's wonderful things that happen in the fall. The air gets crisp and cool. We get to carve out jack-o'-lanterns. The children run around in the little Halloween costumes and collect candy from all the neighbors. I mean, it's a wonderful time of year. I just, I really don't think we should be rushing it. And so I just wanted to get on here to tell you, it's gotta be said, it's gotta be said, it's something that no one else is gonna tell all of you millennials, and so I'm gonna be the one to tell you, because in my generation, people just said what they meant, and they said how they felt, and we all just dealt with it, and we were fine, and we were better people for it. So, it's not fall, shut the hell up. Okay, so my last bit of information for you, and it's really more of a question, because, I just don't understand it. I drive through Starbucks all summer long. Now somebody please help me understand this. And the barista, I think that's the person that you call that's you know out there mixing the coffee like a cocktail, they are wearing a beanie in 100 degree weather. 
Ooh, just throw in a beanie on the actual head. I think it's some sort of a, I think they call it a hipster movement to like wear a crocheted or knitted beanie and act like you've rescued a ton of animals and you somehow are like a better person for this. I don't know what it is. But I do know that that's part of this whole like fall decor thing and this whole like it's fall, yay, we're in a beanie. We're in a beanie in August. You know what I call that? I call that that you're somebody that's deceitful or you just didn't wash your hair. So you're either deceitful and you're throwing a beanie on because you don't want us to know who you are or you're dirty and you didn't wash your hair. Take the beanie off. Shut the hell up. It's not fall. All right, you guys. This has been Aunt Glenda's public service announcement. You know, the more you know, right? So until it's like September 21st, remember, it's not fall. Shut the hell up. I love you.